Hey guys, uh, I just wanted to make another review. I got two new airsoft guns. I got them in Arkansas, so I was just on a trip there a couple like a week ago, and I forgot to make a review. So I'm gonna make a review. And I'm gonna show you the BBs that it takes. Okay, first I'm going to start off with the airsoft. Okay, this is a Z311 zombie edition, you know. It's a zombie. Z311 zombie exterminator. But, uh, it's cool because it's have like a button, like, see this button right there? It makes the clip come off. Yeah. But this is the safety right here. Boom. Or you can put it up. This is what it sounds like, pocket. It's 325 FPS. It's pretty powerful. Probably powerful than my, uh, Crossman R7, R71, R71, my machine gun, it's probably more, I think my Crossman, my other Crossman is probably like, uh, yeah, like 300 FPS, so it's close, maybe, I'm just guessing. This is nice, it looks real from me, it has this, like whenever you cock it back, it doesn't go back like a real gun would, but uh. I have to get rid of the bullet once I caught it so I don't accidentally shoot someone. <laughs> so then I'll forget and I might shoot someone. So, um, yeah, it looks kind of pretty real. Yeah, and here's the clip. It doesn't look too, the clip doesn't help very much because it's thin. You know, it's light. The gun has some good weight to it though. The clip, and that's probably my only concern about this gun so far. But I'll keep you guys in touch on this. It's a Z311 zombie exterminator. So it's pretty cool. And I'll show you the BBs that it takes. It takes, well, what I'm using for it. I'm using, I got 5,000 for like $12.99 at uh, Walmart. Uh, it's 20 grams aggression ammo. So, yeah. That's these zombie exterminators. So check out the Z311. It's pretty cool. It's a nice gun. Okay, and this is a Crossman Recruit. This is like a BB gun. This isn't, uh, or yeah, this isn't. This is like a pellet gun. This isn't a. It's not like these kind of BBs. So metal ones. Okay, <clears throat> so my Crossman Recruit. It's pretty nice. Has a good. Has a good sight on it. There's a little thing that glows in the dark. It's cool. And then, okay, first I'm gonna talk about the scope. Maybe see. It's hard to aim. It works good. I'm gonna aim at something bright. Like, hold it. Okay. Uh, well, it's a. Uh, damn. Okay. okay, well, the scope works really nice. Not so good on the camera, but whatever. Okay. Sorry about wasting your time right there. But the scope works actually really nice. That looks way better than it does. The camera just made it look horrible. But, um, yeah. See the barrel? It has the, uh, it's a smooth barrel. It's not a, a, like a rifle barrel, like a twisted barrel. So, you could change it out, which I don't know how it would be, but, uh, it have better accuracy if you do change it. 
Um, this is, I bought this gun for $43.99 off Amazon. But it said normally it's like 80 something or 70 something, so. I don't know how much it is. It was like on sale or something. So, yeah. But, okay. This is where, okay, it can take BBs and pellets. Like, the BBs go in there. Um, and then there's a little clip thing, which I don't know where it is. Crap. Oh, I guess I lost it. I'll look for it later. But you see that little thing right there? You pull that back, and you can stick it in there. Okay, but it is a pump-action gun. So... This is the noise it makes. It's just one pump. It's not as it's powerful, but not as powerful as a guy. Like usually, the maximum is ten, but not five, ten. But um, I usually do like five or six. Sometimes I go to ten. Just if I'm shooting with birds and stuff, I go to ten. Because you want, I want it to be as powerful as it can be. Yeah, so, um, I BBs like for a recruit. I suggest Daisy because I mean Daisy is like a really good quality. I'm almost at it, so I'm a little bit more. But they're like smooth. Go fat, they get better accuracy because they're smoother. They don't rust like other BBs do, mostly because they're like they're uh, stainless steel and they're not like they don't rust like most BBs do. So it's a really nice gun. It's probably one of the best BB guns. It has it goes 860 feet per second or 680 feet per second, something like that. And it has like 680 FPS. So it's fast, it's nice, very good accuracy, um, I had a lot of fun in Arkansas with it, um, so, yeah, um, oh, yeah, wait, let me show you one more time, it's cool, it has some features like a real gun does, Let's see, and then boom, they shoot it, and they cock it, and it's hard to do it, because I'm, yeah, under my bed, so I can't. And I just shot a baby, Loopy. <laughs> I didn't know I got one in there. Oh, yeah, okay. This is my Craftsman Recruit. I'll show you my guns on the floor. Hold up. I'll put the BBs back where they were. Just get them out of the way. Okay, now I'll show you my BB guns. Not all of them, but just like um, my Crossmoon and my Z311. So, uh, yeah. I don't know how that you see it. So that's a Z311, and that's the Crossman. It's pretty, they're nice. Some of the best BB guns, some of the most powerful BB guns I've ever had. Kind of. They're very powerful. Especially the Z311, I'm surprised. Like, very surprised. So, comment, rate, subscribe. Peace. Yeah, peace.